Police state update. Did you know that the police can now use predator drones to track you down while you're in the U.S.? Yes, they can. Rodney Bossart was arrested by police in Lakota, North Dakota, after being spotted by police. And then they sent a spy drone in to check to see if it was safe. Now, his lawyer, uh, Bruce Quick, says that he, the government, the police, never had any right to use the spy drone. The whole thing is full of constitutional violations. The drone use is a secondary concern. Uh, basically, what happened was the Grand Forks SWAT team actually uh, tracked down the guy and they borrowed the Predator spy drone from the Department of Homeland Security and flew it over where the guy was to see if it was actually safe to approach them. And all of this over supposedly six stolen cows. I know it's a touchy subject for anyone to feel that drones are in the air watch them, but I don't think there was any misuse in this case. No, I think that there was a misuse and I think they're going to continue to be used. I mean, they just proved how effective they are for law enforcement for suppressing the population. Be a legitimate reason or not, they were still proven to be highly effective and thus, as a result, they are going to continue to be used. Now, the Federal Aviation Administration just okayed them, uh, spy drones, uh, possibly specifically predator spy drones to be used in uh, civilian airspace. Now, interestingly, there's been no conservative outcry over this, and really not much in the way of a liberal outcry either. Only privacy activists and people who are really concerned about the government spying on them have actually raised any kind of alarm about this whatsoever. So much for the conservative freakout over uh, big, gov big government coming in and taking over. Now, the fact is, these predator spy drones they're cheaper and more effective than police helicopters. And that's an actual, literal, objective fact. And for that fact alone, they will probably replace police helicopters, making this whole thing even more scary. To be perfectly honest, take a look at this and the reality of what's happened here. This is, this is the police state that's coming and has been coming very slowly for a very long time, but became accelerated after the events of 9-11. And people have been warning about this for a very long time. Technology itself is making it a lot easier for the government to spy on people. I hate to use a cliche, but seriously, people gotta wake up here. This isn't about arresting some guy over six cows. This is about the authorization of technology to be used to spy on people. Seriously, start paying attention. Wait.